Welcome back everyone. In this part we will be adding the 2D sprites to our robot arm. Let's import the Unity package that contains the robot arm texture. You can download this package from the link in the description. Select the texture and go to the inspector. Make sure that the texture type is set to sprite 2D and the mode to multiple. Open the sprite editor. If you get this message, you should install the Sprite2D package. Go to Window, then Package Manager. Search for Sprite2D. Select this package and click Install. Now go back to the Texture Inspector and open the Sprite Editor. We automatically slice the sprites. Move the anchor until it's overlapping with the sprite pivot. Do this for all the sprites that will be rotating. Apply and close the editor. For every joint and arm, we will reset the transform and remove the components that are not needed. After you finish, create an empty game object inside robot and name it stand. Add the sprite renderer as a component and assign the stand sprite to it. To make it face the scene camera, rotate it around the X axis by minus 90 degrees and make sure that you have the scene set to 2D. We do the same for the robot arms. Set the order in layer to 1. To move it we need to move the joint and not the arm. Select joint 0 and move it to the appropriate position. Do the same for the other arms. This time we set the order in layer to 2. Set the order in layer to 3. Move joint 3 to the end effector. Let's reduce the scale of the target. And change the material to red. For a better scene visibility, let's disable the grid and the skybox. And hide the camera icon and the light. Hit run. Great, that's it for this tutorial, I hope it was helpful to you and don't forget to subscribe for the upcoming tutorials, thanks for watching.